Alright, it has been a while, everybody, but welcome back to Hollow Knight. We are at 92% completion. It's been a few weeks. I have no idea where, what we did. Oh, no, that's right. Last time we delivered the flower, didn't we? That was fun. Yeah, I mean, that would be great if I could have some directions. Well, let me, let me take a look at the map first, because maybe I was about to do something that... Again, I probably should have reviewed the footage of my last stream just to see. Oh, I should visit my ex-wife at some point. She have she might have something new for me. That actually might be a good idea. Uh, I cleared the bonus dungeon last time. I went to the the buzzsaw place. That's right, buzzsaw place was last stream. Yeah, there's the Coliseum of Fools. Uh, I did not. Um. My ex-wife, the one, the six-eyed monster living in Green Path, who's like, "You killed this many monsters." <laughs> yeah, let's 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 visit the ex-wife. <laughs> the hunter. Yeah. <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> the same thing. Ah, that's right. Yes, yes. I got the first half. I got half a charm. I would have liked a whole charm, but... Oh, well. Oh, that's right, and I can go for the black bars. Because I got the shadow dash. You are correct. Okay. That gives me a little bit of guidance. Of course, I don't remember where all the... Oh, and I need to get enough Geo to get my strength charm back. I also have to remember I'm not playing Cuphead anymore, and that the controls are a bit different. This is the way to, yep. Keep going to the right, and then we'll have to go a little bit up. That's right, but... So, Buzzsaw Palace? I heard that that was kind of like the bonus dungeon of the game. I didn't think it was that hard. Like, I definitely had some close calls there, but on the whole, it wasn't too difficult to get through. Whoa. Whoa. Was my nail always... Did my nail always have that long reach? Feels like that... I feel like my nail has more reach than it did before. Am I just imagining things? Maybe I am. There are only five in total, but... There are five in total, only three lead to completely new places. I think the black bar in the boiling water that I kept coming across is just a shortcut that leads to an area I've already been to before. Uh, any fun stories from my vacation? Well, I just... I don't know if it's a story, but I, uh... Oh, oh, yeah, I've, I've got a fun story. I'll, I'll tell it when I, uh, listen to this. Ah, uh, your journal grows fat and full. Only those last few rare beasts remain left to stalk. Search the kingdom's corners, complete the journal, earn your well-deserved reward. That, that, that's my ex-wife for you. Nothing's good enough for her. I do great, defeat basically every beast, and she's like, no, there's more. There's more. Okay. I guess I will go over to, yike, to that boiling water uh, with the black bar in it just to see. I'm pretty sure it leads to an area I've already been before, but I'll just double check. Yeah, so my one of my funny stories from Texas. So I, I decided, I'm like, you know, I'll go to a church while I'm down there just to see what Texas churches are like. So I went to... I, I went to one. I went to the 8.30 service. I was basically the only young man there. Everybody else was my grandma's age, which was fun. Uh, I talk, It was a pretty small church, so I, I was, like, kind of shaking hands with him, like, talking to the pastor afterwards. And he's like, oh, hey, like, I haven't seen you around before. Like, uh, like, uh, like, are you new here? I'm like, yeah, I had a bit of a drive to get here. He's like, oh, really? Like, where are you from? I'm like, uh, Michigan. And he's just like, oh, yeah, you win. <laughs> No, everybody was, like, right from in that little town that I was in, but <laughs> then I'm like, yeah, I, I drove all the way from Michigan. <laughs> they didn't really know what to say. It was funny. I also discovered I ate Raising Cane's, which is a, a fast food chicken joint for the first time, and uh, that's the best fast food joint I've ever been to. So, uh, yeah, forget Culver's, forget Chick-fil-A. Raising Cane's is the one to beat. Ha! Ah! Get out of here. 
GB. I'm pretty sure I've been here before, right? Yeah, that just connects back to the fungal wastes, doesn't it? Okay, I've got to consult my memory of where the other black bars are. Maybe there's one down here? Where, see that area down at the bottom of the deep nest, where there are the two entrances that lead off in that direction, but they don't lead anywhere? Maybe that's one of them? We can try. We could try. I don't know. Is there a nearby... Hmm. Is there a nearby stag station for that? It doesn't look like it. Deep Nest is kind of in the middle of nowhere. There's a tram station next to it. Wait, really? <laughs> oh, I didn't, I didn't have that. <laughs> I, I just got ignored by pretty much everybody. Which, I mean, hey, I get it. If it's, a, if it's like a well-established community of friends already, it, it's hard if an outsider shows up. You know, at, at least I didn't have the church ladies trying to set me up with their granddaughters. That's always a little uncomfortable. Ouch. Oh yeah, I need to heal. Okay. I gotta, I gotta plan this out a bit. Alright. How do I get all the way down there? So... Oh, there is a... There is a stag station over in the... That's right. Okay, where's the nearest stag station to me right now? Oh, uh, let's see. Probably... Queen Station. Okay, so I'm going the wrong way. Apparently there was a bomb on the ground. That's fun. McDonald's is your fast food chain of choice? We gotta fix that. There's nothing wrong with McDonald's, but I mean, there are so many better options out there. And also, like, it used to be McDonald's' main, main draw was its cheapness. It ain't even that cheap anymore. So, like, I'm at the point where I'm like, man, if, I, if I'm eating out... I'm, I'm going for quality. Because, uh, to be honest, it's even expensive to eat in. I, I went to the store earlier today. I only got a few things, and it was over 100 bucks. It was nuts. Granted, I went to Costco, so I bought in bulk. And I did buy a bunch of meat, which is expensive. I agree. But still, I think I've only bought... I bought fewer than 10 things. The chicken I bought alone was 40 bucks? I have not played Reader Rabbit second grade, no. I managed to pass second grade without it. I Chick-fil-A is definitely amazing. Wendy's... Okay, I have mixed feelings on Wendy's, because I used to work at a Wendy's, so that kind of ruined it for me a little bit. Just a tad. I admit that its quality is definitely higher than your average fast food joint, but it's also... You have to pay extra for that. Uh, Hidden Station, I think, is the one. Taco Bell is not a good fast food chain, no. Fast, fast food joints are... are <laughs> Taco Bell? I'm not... I'm not sure if I'm at the point where I'd rather just not eat a meal than eat at Taco Bell, but I'm close to that point. Taco Bell is extremely cheap, but also that is very much a case of you get what you pay for. Shots fired. If you like Taco Bell, good for you, but just don't make me eat at Taco Bell. That's that's kind of how I go. That's that's how I be. <laughs> oh, that's right. This area. Uh, oh, that's right. Dairy Queen does have food besides ice cream. I, w I would never get something from Dairy Queen that's not ice cream. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm at the stag station. Aw. Aw. Sorry to hear that you lost your arm. That's sad. 
Sounds like you're taking it in stride, though, so... <laughs> I'm, I'm happy for that, at least. Chipotle. I, have I been to Chipotle before? I don't know. I can't think of a time where I have been to Chipotle. Chipotle. <laughs> oh, perfect. The, the tram took me right over here. Oh, yeah, I guess we're playing Hollow Knight, but mostly we're talking about fast food joints. This is how Artie's streams usually devolve. It's like, wow, I'm playing this amazing indie game. It's like, blows my mind. Like, no, forget that. Here's why Taco Bell is terrible. <laughs> How did my... Ra Where did my raid alert come from? Uh, it came from P Spy Fox 2. That's the, the... So my raid alert is LaRoche, who is the villain of Spy Fox 2 dancing. It's great. Here we go. Shwink! New area. Alright, this is a cool... Ah, okay. Oh, that's how we're gonna do it. That is a tough one to get through. That is quite an accident. No, I don't want to pry. <laughs> Sharp Shadow, new badge. Woo woo! Oh, that was a smaller area than I was expecting. Sharp Shadow, one of your favorite charms. Okay, well, I gotta take a look at it then. I need a bench! Speaking of old people, I need a bench. <laughs> It's also come to my attention that I'm close to a thousand subscribers on YouTube, which feels very weird. So I gotta think of if I ever reach that point, <laughs> what I would want to do as a special. Because I have truly no idea. It boggles my mind that there are as many people that follow me as there is, because I literally am just a random guy who plays games and talks about fast food a lot. But I appreciate y'all very much. I even and I also appreciate those of you who are not subscribed. There is no pressure to do so. I just it humbled me to see that number. And honestly, usually when I figure out about the number, it's just because somebody comments like, "Hey, you're close to this match." And I'm like, "Wait, I am." <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Big toe reveal? <laughs> Guys, you do realize that Artie doesn't have toes. Colorful Artie is an inkblot without toes. Also, if I do that, people are just gonna get weird and be like, Oh, Artie, oh, you're in defeat, huh? Because apparently that's a thing. Alright, let's see what this is. Sar Sharp Shadow contains a forbidden spell that transforms shadows into deadly weapons. When using the Shadow Dash, the bearer's body will sharpen and damage... And what? That sounds great! <laughs> So my dash, my dash attack will now, damn it. Wow, that sounds really good. All right. Let's see if there's more dead-end paths that I haven't been able to explore. There's one over there. Hey, congrats. I got to do a face reveal, but I'm just wearing a blue blob mask over your face. Guys, do you not realize that you've already seen Artie's face? My face is my avatar. Again, Artie's an inkblot. Now, if you're wanting to see the voice actor who plays colorful Artie's face, that's another, that's another story. Where was I going to go again? Uh, not the wrestling grounds, King Station. That's the one. <laughs> oh, I, that's right. I have Mark of Pride equipped. That's That makes sense why my nail is... I'm like, I'm pretty sure that nail is a lot longer than it should be. I don't have a blue blob mask. I do actually have a Plague Doctor mask, though. And when I play Among Us, I pretty much always wear the Plague Doctor mask, so maybe I could do that. 
Except, again, that would just... People would just be like, wow, really? We wanted a real face reveal. Luigi! I'm not telling you Marty's face. It's a lot more important to keep my sister's face private than mine. As girls generally have to deal with more, um... Girls have to be more careful about that. I'll just say. Ooh! Someone cosplayed as Hollow Knight. That's really cool. Okay, Kingdom's Edge. Oh, I'm pretty high up. That's the real thing. I'm just... I'm so wary of... Because... There's no real privacy on the internet, and once people have your face, they can figure out basically anything about you. Also, I'm pretty sure whether you guys realize it or not, you all probably have some internal thought of what I look like. And you know what? <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to ruin people's uh, expectations. Oh, you! Oh man. You can jump so high in this game compared to Cuphead. <laughs> you always picture me as an inkblot. Well, you know what? That's not far off, because Artie is an inkblot. Oh, I didn't go low enough. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, you got... If, especially because I'm a person who values privacy pretty highly, so... Wait, did I miss it? No, I did not. Aha! Zoom shakalaka! Well, if you go to, like, an anime convention, then... It's pretty easy to go and, like, wear a mask, and you won't be out of place. You have come a long way just to die here at the edge of the world. I'm not here to die! Hey, Markov. No, do not speak. I have heard thousands and thousands of empty words from those like you. Your pride, your desires, your desperation. You will take these things with you once I strike you down. Raise your weapon, then, and die like those who came before you. Challenge the warrior dream? Yeah. Okay, he's got a lotus flower that shoots stuff at me? Oh, that's right, and one other- I still have to beat freaking Zote the Mighty. Ouch. Those Lances he's throwing at me actually can pass through solid walls. This is not the Wave Beam. Oh, now he's got- now he has two! You are mine! Uh oh. Okay, this guy's putting up a fight. No, no, he's not. That wasn't too bad. Never have I been defeated in combat. Well, you're dead next to a bunch of weapons, so I kind of think you might be lying. I can see myself there, still sleeping. How long have I been hidden here? Here at the edge of the world. No one could find me, except you. Warriors, knights, keens, even time itself. They have no power over me. Only you. I am the king. You are the darkness. Come to consume me. I'm not confirming that. But if you want to think that... Oh, I got 2,000! The body of a warrior with a shield and nails. Cool. So now... 
we can go back to the resting grounds and get our new prize, maybe. I think that 2,000 was the next milestone. Um, what else? Are there any other dead ends? There's presumably a dead end somewhere. Uh, there's one that I can go up from in the Crystal Peak. The problem is, the dash don't work vertically, so I don't think it was a black barrier that was slowing me down there. Hmm. Could be over there, in the Queen's Gardens. You can see that horizontal area. Yeah, Queen's Gardens seems like a good spot to go to next. All right. Yeah, let's try to get back to that stag station. I also need to get more Geo. I really want that. Once I get the... St oh, I need to make sure I don't die. Once I get my enough Geo to get my strength upgrade back, I am going to try Zote again. Because I think if I can deal extra damage... That's going to be the key to helping me beat him. Mmm, the land of Dandruff. How many relics do I have right now? I think I sold them all. No, I have one Wanderer's Journal and one Ancient Egg. And 16 Rancid Eggs, but nobody seems to want those. Oh, wait, hang on a second. I also have... A simple key! I have one simple key left. I have two pale ore. I need one more pale ore in order to get my nail upgraded again. Okay. Good thinking, Toad. Am I even going the right way? Probably not. I've been streaming this for almost 30 weeks. And I just don't know where to go still. You are correct. Uh, the problem is I don't remember where the simple door is. What the heck? That guy just died. <laughs> yeah, I think that's about right. Little did I know that Hollow Knight would take this long. Little did I know that this tiny little indie game was actually huge and longer than most Metroid games that I've played. Ooh, speaking of which, if that's if it's not already on there, Metroid Zero Mission would be another fun game to stream someday. Alright, well, if I can't get enough Geo from selling the relics at this point, I'll go over to the Queen's Gardens. Yeah, Zero Mission, one of my favorite, probably my number two favorite Metroid game. Metroid Prime is number one. Which is fun, which is funny, because I usually don't go for the first person shooter genre, but. Metroid Prime is an exception. Do I plan on streaming more Paper Mario Challenge Runs? Um... Challenge Runs? Probably not. I have no plans to do that. More randomizers? Probably. Welcome back. I keep for... Man, plain cuphead... Ah! The, do I dash for longer now? Because it feels like I do. I think I'm just used to Cuphead where your dash is... Yeah, I think I'm just used to Cuphead where your dash is a lot less. Maybe not, though. It feels like I'm dashing farther than I did in the past. Okay, yeah, I think this way. There we go! Joink! Sh 
Sharp Shadow increases your Shadow Dash length, as well as dealing damage. That's okay. So I'm not crazy. Oh, hey, it's a Mantis. I haven't sat on a bench in a while, have I? Or actually, no, I think I... Wait. Oh, it's you! I thought you were a boss. But you're a friend! Thanks for the help! Oh, there might be more. Oh, the Traitor Lord! Uh-oh. Traitor Lord deals a lot of damage. Well, I hope I sat on that bench. Yeah, I think I'm unequipping the shadow. Uh, no, I didn't sit on the bench in the Queen's Gardens, but I am still close by. That's a fun badge, but I don't think it's for me. At least not in this moment. Oh yeah, the nail arts. I forget. I forgot about the nail arts. Quick slash. I love. Oh no, it's too much. Fine. I love Quick Slash. Quick Slash is my go to. Well, I'm gonna have to go and get my money back, guaranteed. This should be a badge that just turns the game into Cuphead. At least when you're in a boss fight. Ha ha! Good point! Okay, if... You... The fact that you're recommending that and you normally don't... Yeah, okay. I, I to take that seriously. I will... I will do that. Thank you. Knowing how stubborn I am, I would probably just not do that. And the Colosseum isn't that hard to get back to without a Dream Gate, so... Something tells me that I'm now at the beginning of a tough boss, judging by Twitch chat's reactions. Who's the... Okay, hang on. I need to remember... Dream Gate, hold down to set, and hold up to travel. Okay, so I want to hold down. Alrighty, there we go. Ha ha, thank you! That boss didn't seem like it was gonna be super hard, but... Just judging by everyone's reactions in Twitch chat, I'm like, okay, this boss might be harder than it looks. Traitor Lord! Oh, oh, I see. You have to Shadow Dash through those. Okay, yeah. Alright, there's more to this fight than meets the eye. There's more to this fight than meets the eye. Alright, alright. I never thought that the Dream Gate would be useful for going quickly to bosses over and over again.
It's interesting how the boss is just like a bigger version of these regular mantises. Thank you, Big Bertha. I know that's not your name, but... Traitor! Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of, uh... muscle memory that I need to train. Wow! Wow! Wrecked! Okay. If this is the case, I don't need my compass anymore. That's alright. What, what, what might help in this fight? Spider friends could help, but... I'd rather not. Soul Catcher might help, but... Hmm... Not Shaman Stone... This is one fight where that Sharp Shadow actually might be quite useful. Maybe not Quick Slash. Let's try Sharp Shadow, because I'm going to be dashing a lot in this fight. Her name is Cloth, but Burf is a nicer name. <laughs> Perhaps. The Grim Child. Balder Shell could be nice in this fight, too. Just in case my shadow runs out of... Yeah, let's try that. Aha! Yes, give me it. Thank you. I don't remember the mantises being this annoying. Oh wait, yes I do. <laughs> This is definitely an interesting fight. Whoop. No, couldn't duh, couldn't jump over it. I feel like Cloth is not doing a whole lot to help out in this fight. If I, if I may be frank. <laughs> as long as you cheer for my team, then that's fine. I need my extra power charm. Ha 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 ha.
Nice job. Wow! Landed on top of me. So if you're the traitor, then who did you betray? Man, I'm digging the extra long range nail in this fight. It's really helping out. No! Oh, well done, Cloth. Execution. Uh-oh. Was that a mutual kill? Oh, interesting. Well, uh, that's not good. I can't even dream nail her. No, she just, she dead. I feel like if I had done a better job attacking the boss, would I have been able to save her? I did not kill her. Traitor did. Mantis House. Who lives here? Come on, Ber Berfa went out like a boss. Literally went out like a boss, killing a boss. Whoa! Hello! Oh, one arrives. Far it walks to find me. Did it seek my aid? Or did the path carry it by chance to so pertinent a place? It is true. True that you were awaited. No, perhaps that is inaccurate. True one like you was awaited. I have a gift, held long for one of your kind, half of a whole. When united, a great power is granted, and on the path ahead, great power it will need. Rest in peace, Big Bertha. Your sacrifice will not go in vain. The other half of the charm? Yep. Collected the keen soul. Oh, ho Can't wait to see what that does. It faced the gendered child. She's a fierce foe, strong in mind and body, striking reflection of her mother, though the two were permitted little time together. I never begrudged the worm's dalliance as bargain. In fact, I feel some affection for the creature burved. If your paths were ever to align, I imagine you might gain yourself a powerful ally. Are you talking about Hornet, maybe? I would not go around calling Hornet gendered child, because that describes literally every child who's ever been born. Very vague, but alright. <laughs> I just killed the dragonfly that was wandering around. My ex-wife approves. Wait, I didn't dream nail her. So it can access a mind, then the seals shall break before its blade. 
Uh oh, she know she's on to me. Ooh, at most of the vessels, including the player character, are genderless. Really? It's not how bugs be working in real life. Oh, you are dead. Well, now that was something! A true battle of mighty warriors! So intense, so climactic, it's really everything I could have ever hoped for. Thanks for all your help, my friend. For a tiny bug, you set a valiant example. We'll meet again, I'm sure of it. I was wondering if that would be a special fight against Big Burfa. Burfa will always be with us, in our hearts, and our dream nail. <laughs> the answer is yes. Oh no! <laughs> Getting through this area with the shadow dash is, uh, it's, well, an experience. <laughs> just for that, you'll hate cicadas a little less. <laughs> cicadas are just so dang loud, man. It's like, oh man, what a perfect summer day. It's just beautiful. Beep, 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 beep. I have no idea how cicadas can make that much noise. Ow, my bottom. Alright. Keen soul. Keen soul. What's it do? What's it do? Five. Holy charm symbolizing a union between higher beings. The bearer will slowly absorb limitless soul contained within. Wait, I didn't say go to the next page. I want to finish reading it. Opens the way to a birthplace. Well, we got to equip that then. Keen soul. And we'll get the long nail. I don't know what the birthplace means, but maybe it's the egg. Okay, well, first up, we're going back to, uh... I think King Station is the closest one to the relic shop. So... Oh, wow, yeah, I'm just constantly getting soul from this. Next, I have to solve the riddle and find the birthplace. Well, my first thought is that it's the giant freaking egg where the final boss, the Hollow Knight, is. Ow. How wooed. I can already go inside the egg. Maybe there's a special place inside the egg. Also, there's still other badges I haven't found. Oh, I don't have the compass. I need that compass or I get lost. Memorial to the Hollow Knight. Why do I keep checking my map? It's not like I can see anything. Wait. This might be which what leads to the swordsmith. No, it doesn't lead to the swordsmith. That leads to the swordsmith.
Oh wait, I went too far. Or not far enough. You were just hiding in the loading zone, waiting for me. Wanderer's Journal for 200. A Wanderer's Journal. It's quite incredible how many of these you've collected. You must have traveled the breadth of the kingdom to accrue such a haul. An arcane egg. Give it. Here you go. Another arcane egg. It's a rare chance to own two of these. I'll be the envy of all my colleagues, though my purse is feeling much lighter for it. These eggs are the most desired find from time before Hollow Nest, but they're not the only remnant of that age. You may have come upon them, those old statues that seem to store for soul. They too prove its existence, though in a larger, cruder form. Hmm, looks like you don't have any relics on you. If you manage to find any in good condition, bring them to me and I'll give you a fair amount of geo for them. I need 300 bucks. That's it. I kind of want to grind. Oh, wait. I needed 15,000 to get my charm back, or did I need 14,000? I can't remember, because I am a goldfish. This is a nice looking place. This is where the lady's laughing, that's right. I need 15,000. I can easily grind the last bit by killing the enemies in Rice side or the hoppers in Kingdom Edge. Edge. Or... I could go to the Forgotten Crossroads. But, yeah, let's see... Ah, thank you. Yeah, I, I do... I sneeze a good amount. So why did you talk to me if you didn't want to board? Or I could kill the bees. Man, I wish I could jump up walls like that. No, I don't want to deal with the shotgun bugs. Yes, the bees. Hmm. <laughs> All right. We got to kill, 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 kill. Slay, it ain't so. Big Boy only gives us 7 Geo. And then, like, the little hopping guys give us, like, 17.
<laughs> Snape bug is dead, yes, Mr. Potter. Feels like everybody's dying these days. <laughs> Whoa, 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 no, 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 I don't want to fall down here. I don't think I do. Maybe this is actually the way I do want to go. Actually, I think there are a couple fat boys down here. Yes! There we go. Marshmallow could have died if I didn't save him the first time we met. Really? So I saved the tool, I just didn't save the actual good characters. Yeah, that's in character for me. There we go. Shotgun bug. Does that mean that you can permanently miss out on the the optional Zote bonus bosses? If he dies? Yes, you can. So there's permanently missable content in this game. Uh... Maybe this is a spoiler to ask, but have I missed out on any permanently missable content? Except for a few one way or the other things, you can only do one thing per save file. Okay. Stop killing the cute characters. No, they have to kill the cute characters so you feel bad about them dying. That's the only way the game's gonna make you feel like a jerk for letting the characters die. But joke's on them, because I don't care about video game characters. <laughs> Dirt mouth. Where? Okay, here's the lady who's extorting me. Again, so greedy. Wait, no, I do want to pay the gift. You've been digesting that for a long time. Unbreakable strength. Booyah. Okay, let's try Zode again. So this time we're going Unbreakable Strength. What else? I like the Balder Shell. I like the Quick Slash. Mm, what else? I mean, the King Soul would be great, but also... No, you know what? 
Let's try the cane soul. I want to see if I can beat Zote now that I've got the strength boost. Well, that didn't last long. <laughs> yeah, this guy's tough. Shadow Dash definitely helps a lot in this fight. Whoa! Something blew me up, apparently. <laughs> Alright, I felt, I felt like I was actually kind of holding my own there for a bit. I feel like the strength upgrade, I'm not really noticing all that much, but I'm definitely noticing all of the shadow upgrades. I didn't even see the Zolt lane there. King Soul is great for this fight. I hate how he can just change where he's like going to land, though, to land on you. That stinks. <laughs> There's nothing to notice if the strike over it just ends up. Well, I didn't. But, like, after you deal enough damage to him, he gets knocked on the ground and you can heal. I don't notice him getting knocked to the ground any sooner. If anything, it's taking him longer to get knocked to the ground than what I'm used to.
I feel like my quick slash isn't being as effective as it usually. Actually, wait, did I even a quick? I don't have quick slash on. That's why. I have the ball. The balder shell is not going to be very. I should probably unequip balder shell. Or just be willing to use it more, even if I'm not using it specifically to heal. Oh yeah, the strength upgrade is great for dealing with the little zodes. Strength upgrade is going to be super nice for dealing with the little zotes. Which means maybe I don't want the keen soul. Because I normally would want the keen soul so I could do all these dashes to deal with them. But if I can just hit them with one strike of the nail now and kill them, maybe my pins are better spent on other things. Okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna re-equip some badges then. Definitely keeping the strength upgrade. But I think the Balder Shell and the King Soul I actually could unequip. I'm not using the Balder Shell enough. Alright. No and no. So what would go well with all of these? Oh, let's see. Maybe... Let's try the Sharp Shadow. And maybe Quick Focus could be nice. Nah, I don't think so. Not Quick Focus. Let's try Quick Slash. Quick Slash I think would be really good. Then maybe I could equip like Steady Body and Grub Song. Or Lone Nail. Let's try this, this like, pure offensive combo. Quick, qu quick slash plus the unbreakable strength might just wreck this guy, actually. And the, the extra speed you get from the dash, I think, will be really nice as well. No, 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 no. Staggers are based on the number of hits? Interesting. Not number of damage. Yeah, this definitely seems to be a good combination of stuff. Oh! Yeah, he's gone! Pff, yeah, that just wrecked him. <laughs> Come on, that, that better be the last Zote fight. No, is there still another? It's still glowing! So that it seems to indicate there is still another. Wonderful. 
<laughs> oh, she's not here anymore! <laughs> Precepts six, choose your own fate. Our elders teach that fate is chosen for us before we are even born. I disagree. <laughs> she just left him and he doesn't even notice. Oh, that's, that's hilarious. Where'd she go then? Oh, oh shoot, wait, that's that's a new vein. Oh, hang on. This is a new uh, The maiden's quest. Her grey prince diminished and her white savior revealed a, as beast. The maiden at last understood the truth. Her life's companion would not appear. For they could not appear to a maiden sat idle. She must instead seek them out. Must find her love and free them of her solid, free them of their solitude, and thus her own journey began out into dangerous lands, shielded by her love awaiting, guided by her love to be. With every step, the maiden could feel it, their fated meeting coming ever closer. I mean, that's good for you. It's all right. You can't just sit on your butt and think something's gonna fall into your lap. Hmm. Nice. Good for you. I hope you brought a weapon of some kind, though, because it's a dangerous world out there. But this is still glowing. She's still here. Enchanted figures still you overwhelming. Is this another one? Oh my gosh, she deals free damage now. What the heck? Okay, so it is a different fight. He deals free damage now. Still, I beat him once. Doesn't really make sense why she's still dreaming about him then. Uh, so hot take, there are too many Zolt battles in this. Dang. There are, there are way too many. Maybe there could have been two. Maybe three, but four and five are just far too much. It took you a long time after Zote 4 to beat this one. Interesting. Thanks for wor not working, Dash, bro. Oh man! Um, I might do the Mr. Mushroom this stream. I'm gonna try Zote maybe a few more times, but if it seems like he's just brutally difficult, then I'm, I'm out. But with Quick Slash and the Strength Upgrade, as long as I'm skilled enough to avoid a lot of his attacks, I think he should be doable, unless he gets way too much more HP. <laughs> hey, Narwhal Bean, welcome. This is the fifth fight against Zote. The developers kind of ran out of ideas for boss fights after the, after all these.
Yeah, I take that. After Zote 4, he doesn't gain any HP, only damage. That is dumb. Very dumb. All right, I'm not. I'm not fighting him anymore. Yeah, he's not saying anything new. Well, gr that's great, Zote. <laughs> Gotta get my compass. I like the keen soul. I like the Cena. I like the Moon and the Juna and the Sprina. Let's do that. All right, off to the fungal wastes we go. Hi ho, hi ho. Uh, which I think Queen Station is near fungal. Oh, and I need to have the spore shroom equipped. Well, that's fine. I can unequip the steady body. Ha cha cha cha. Excuse me, it's rude to spew fumes. All right. So I believe I, I already found him that one time at the beginning. So now is it just like rooting around the fungal wastes until you happen to find the mushroom guy? Poem contains the clues for all the locations. I don't know what poem you're talking about. Warily shall we accept the will of the worm. Its presence shields us, fate and future shall entwine. I was not looking at the screen. Go to the Nail Master's Hut in the bottom right hand corner of the Kingdom's Edge. There's a. Why would there be a poem there about a mushroom over here? Seems a little. Uncouth. Because Team Cherry. Of course. Whoosh. I think the city storerooms might technically be closer, but... It's a lot of vertical elevator traveling, and I'd rather go here to the King's Station. How, um, I mean, Hollow Knight Randomizer doesn't really appeal to me, at least not right now. Silk Psalm is quite possible in the future, but, again, I've been playing Hollow Knight for so many months now that <laughs> I don't think I'll be playing a Hollow Knight stream again for a while. Once I finish with this. Hey! Congrats! Nice... New computer's always exciting. We fly back home with the help of Super Grover. I definitely will be at the end of this stream. Or not the end of the stream, at the end of the stream series.
Oh, I thought you were talking about the guy who upgrades your nail. When you said the nail master. I'm kind of enjoying it. Nail Brother Oreo? If he's not scening for me, then I really don't care about him. Find the scening Oreo. Win big. I don't think there actually was a scening Oreo. I think that was one of those conspiracies that I was lied to about. <laughs> one of those little white lies that everyone tells you about, but it's not actually true. Like, HR is there to help you. Strength upgrade might help with the arena. <laughs> oh, I do remember those. Fair enough. Okay. Cats. Let's see. Where did? Where is Oreo? Uh, beep, 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 beep. bottom right corner. So I. It's probably by that bench. Oreo. 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 Cool, I did not go too low. <laughs> Have some candy! don't have time for you today. Nope. Out of my way, you big bugs. No time for you today. Oh, is this the weird area that people are like, wait, there's more here. Wait, what? I... No, I don't want to jump down here, actually. I need to find a secret that I missed somewhere in the caves, eh? You know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna read the poem and be like, okay, well, that's it for this stream, everybody. Thanks for watching. And then I'm gonna completely forget about it the next time. There's like a 90% chance that's what's going to happen. Look at all those spores. Wait, did I not find a rancid egg? I missed a rancid egg. Not that they do anything. I'm half convinced the rancid eggs are completely worthless collectibles. Ouch. He 
he he enter I forget where I've already been in this cave and where I haven't so this will be fun well, I mean, I am definitely going to end the stream after I find the poem. The 10% is that there's a 10% chance I'll actually remember the poem for next time. We speak the path of the Master Herald, he who would signal an age's end. Spawn of self, their minds unite, aside the source of acid blight. Okay. A glow in darkest winding depths, winds all howl above fossil stone steps. Monarch flies and airs set still, to root's domain and snail once shrill. Path of worm at new lands entered, their journey's end the kingdom ventured. Yeah, I'm not gonna remember that. But, I have it recorded, so that way I can always just pull it up next time I stream this. Wait. This actually doesn't lead out. This leads deeper in. Those are extremely vague cryptic clues, and I think I'd rather just look it up on GameFAQs. Remember when GameFAQs was a thing for kids? I do. This is back before the days of, like, YouTube, or Wiki. I remember back in the days when I couldn't figure out the solution to a Lemmings level. I had to consult game facts. Ow. Oh, that's cool. I guess you're kind of old school like me, though, Proxima, so... Ooh, that's, that's the true hardcore gamer move. You actually read the game manuals. that. Boom! <laughs> Just a tad. But I'm I'm an old soul, though. That's the thing. I may be still be in my mid-twenties, but I feel like I'm 60 years old at times. Not physically, just mentally. Like, all of the stuff where it's like, oh yeah, young kids these days, or it's just like, young people love doing this, it's like, I know I don't. It's like, young people love going to the bar and, like, drinking and hanging out and, like, singing karaoke with friends. I'm like, that sounds terrible. I would hate that. If you don't enjoy drinking alcohol, social situations get a lot harder. Am I the youngest in this chat room? Out of me, you, Proxima, and DX, I believe I am. Yeah, actually. I mean, I'm 26 now, but I've only been 26 for about a month, so. All right, well, we made actually, we made some great progress in Hollow Knight today. We beat Zote. We did some other stuff that I already forgot about. <laughs> we explored beyond the different ways. Someone died. I got the, the Keen badge, the Keen soul. Oh yeah, I need to find the uh, the burfing place next time, which is uh, a little cryptic, but I'll have to I'll have to think on it. <laughs> we did get the complete cane soul, which is great. How many ba how many badges do we have left? One, two, three, four, five. We have five badges left, and I think one of them is the badge we get for getting all of the other badges and going back to the badge shop. That's that's kind of what I'm thinking. That's what I'm guessing. So. Did I forget how the poem went? I remember some of the words. I already forgot most of it. <laughs> I'm not really a uh, not really a poetry guy, so to speak. I don't know. Poetry to me always just seems kind of bleh. I don't. Maybe I don't understand it, but 
I don't know. I just feel like people are like, I can write whatever I want, and it's just, it's poetry. It's like, or you just wrote gibberish. You decide. <laughs> All right, well, that's going to do it for this episode of Hollow Knight, everybody. Thanks for joining in, and thanks for all your help tonight. I, it was greatly appreciated, and yeah, we're, we're getting there. We're at, how, how much percent do we have? Are we at, like, 90? Can we check? 97% completion! We started the stream at, I think, 92 or 94, which means that if we have the same level of progress, we can get to 100% completion next stream, which will be on Wednesday. And I am going to be looking forward to Wednesday's stream because tomorrow and Wednesday's days at work will probably not be particularly fun. But that's okay. We all have hard days. We just got to get through them. You know what I'm saying? Anyhow, I've been eating up too much of Euro's time. Thank you all so much for joining in. It was truly a pleasure playing this tonight. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your night. And God bless everyone.